to meal prep for about two days. So I wanted you guys to kind of see how I do that. Um, the first thing I'm gonna do, which I haven't done yet, is I'm going to figure out how much of each food group I need for at least two days. Um, so I will do that and then from there I will measure everything out into my containers. <clears throat> but um, for protein, I am going to do hard boiled eggs, which I'm gonna pick up at the grocery store. I, didn't, I forgot them. Um, and I'm also going to do, I'm just going to cook ground turkey with a little bit of olive oil. I'm going to bake chicken and I'm going to season those with the Flavor God seasonings. I don't know which ones yet. I mix it up. And um, from there, I'm going to take my orange container and I'm going to measure out the chia seeds. And I'm going to put those in small snack size Ziploc bags because I eat them in my oatmeal in the morning. And then these oatmeal packets are <clears throat> organic and they're, they don't have anything except for oats in them. And they're already measured out to the same size as a yellow container I figured out. So um, I will just take enough of those for the time that I'm gone. Um, for my healthy fats, what's easiest for me, um, I love eating avocado and that sort of thing, but it's kind of hard to take that and um, it turns brown. So um, I'm going to do raw almonds so I'm going to put those in there and then I found these cool little um, peanut butter almond butter I don't know if you guys can see in coconut oil packs and I'm going to double check but I believe they're the exact amount that I will need for one day so I can just pick if I want to do almond butter for the day or coconut oil and those are already ready to go <clears throat> I'm going to bake sweet potatoes and in those when I eat them I actually put about a teaspoon of coconut oil on there and cinnamon or some kind of flavor god seasoning um, and <clears throat> for, I'm gonna bring bananas but fruits easy to get um, I'm probably gonna bring some apples and stuff um, and then for my vegetables I just it just depends on what I want that day so I'm cutting up a lot of different kinds of peppers carrots and some beans so that's um, what I'm gonna be prepping I'm also making rice sorry that was the thing I was missing so I'm gonna make brown rice and measure that out into the containers. So each one of my six pack containers usually holds one carb, one protein, and either extra eggs or two veggies. Like you can fit a lot in these things. So I have five of those. So what I do is I figure out how much of each I'm gonna need, cook up all the food. If I have anything left over, I throw it in the freezer. And then I just measure them out. Um, usually a veggie, a protein, and a carb, at least in each container. And then I see what extras I can fit in there. So that's how I do it. It's super simple. I eat really simple, especially when I'm um, traveling. Uh, it's I don't like overcomplicating it. So if you're out and about and you run out of something, um, there's a couple things you can do. Um, you can go to the grocery store and get hard-boiled eggs. They're already cooked. So that's a big thing that I do. And then you can get vegetables that are already cut up and ready to go. Um, so there's things you can do to make it easier and if you forget something, uh, there's a way around it. You can get sweet potatoes and throw them in the microwave. I mean, <laughs> there's a microwave in every hotel. So um, that's what I'm doing for this trip and I hope that was helpful.